Ginger's hunting. She thinks she's gonna see something. So, anyways, guys, uh, this video is about scrub blade wipers, uh, new wipers for the Forerunner, and and actually for the wife's car also. Uh, just to give a quick rundown timeline of things. Uh, received some scrub blade wipers back in January. Uh, in all honesty, they were provided to me to test out. Uh, so I didn't actually put any money into them, but that didn't affect how I feel about them. I, I still think in the end I'm gonna buy them again when it comes time. Uh, so in January got new wipers, didn't get to install them until April. Uh, first part of my year got pretty crazy, pretty nuts. So uh, anyways, had them on my Forerunner since mid-April. Uh, installed them on the wife's car a couple weeks ago and actually just a couple days ago got a new rear wiper for her car, which is a new product from Scrub Blade. Uh, so here it is today, June 7th, the day after D-Day. Uh, and it's putting together the video, some stuff I've compiled since I installed them on my 4Runner. Uh, some video of them being used, some video of them scrubbing the bugs off the windshield. Uh, so just wanted to kind of preface the video with that information and let you go and, and let you watch it. Just want to let you know if you are interested in them, uh, there is a discount code for them directly from Scrub Blade. And I'll put the link to that in the description below. So uh, with that being said, this is kind of the last couple few months of video of the wipers. So here it is. All right, so we're gonna do a quick install, uh, heavy duty scrub blade wipers. Uh, wipers on the Forerunner, got about 21,000 miles on them. Got me through the summer and uh, we're gonna put these new ones on there. Packaging looks good, you know. Quality wiper blade, I don't doubt. We're just gonna find out how quality. Uh, Forerunner takes a 20 inch blade and a 24 inch blade. So not much to the install. Uh, pretty simple clips. We're not really gonna do a tutorial on it, but just so we can see. Factory blades, just gonna pop the clips up, slide them off and pop the new ones on. So we'll see how these work. We got a little bit of rain coming in, of course, because it's Oregon. Uh, and we do got to run around some tonight, so get a good first night review, but this video won't be uh, put on YouTube probably until we get these things on for a few weeks just to make sure they hold up. So we're gonna get them on here. Just to show, this is what Scrub Blade says makes them unique. One of the things is there are two blades and it's got these little scrubbers on the edges, which I'm hoping work really good to help with bugs and such. So that's the, uh, that's the Scrub Blade. And I'll tell you, I don't see anything that says these aren't as quality as anything else. Uh, is any other nice wiper, so I don't doubt these are gonna work. We're just gonna see how good. One other thing to note is these are the heavy duty blades, uh, they make, I don't think all a standard or a regular one, but it's more of the single arm, the more modern, uh, like see on a lot of cars. In fact, what you see factory on the Forerunner, uh, scrub blade and reviews both said, get the heavy duty ones. It's got the actual arm with multiple pressure points. So it's supposed to work better on the Forerunner. Uh, something about the, the single blade ones don't actually contact the windshield all the way. So they were pretty open about it. Said, nope, get the heavy duty. So that's what these are going. That's what these are going on the rig. One thing I noticed with these blades is they don't have a lock necessarily secures them into the J hook like a lot of wipers do and like factory wipers do, but there's a little detent, but I guess they're trusting that to be enough. Gotta snug it up. I see no reason why it wouldn't be. There we go. And they're on there pretty good. It's not an actual lock like 
water wipers do. These factory ones, I don't know who makes them, but they got the this retainer clip that keeps them from backing off. But again, maybe they're not that necessary. And just for kicks, I did look at the instructions and they are a little humorous. So uh, if not for install purposes, they're worth checking out to read just to get a quick laugh. So that's that, they're on. I'm just gonna clean the windshield um, and then we'll get some videos of how well they work, get some reviews in a few weeks and get it going. So I'll let you guys know. All right, so just hit a bug right there. We're gonna hit it with these uh, scrub blade wipers, see what it does. There we go. No, no washer fluid. Let's just see if it smears it. Oh yeah, it smears it like I expected. So we'll just hit it with some fluid. Well, we got most of it off. And It's gone, so I guess if that means anything, took care of that bug. So, all right, back on the road. All right, it is probably super hard to tell because it's dark, but uh, we've been slaying bugs uh, with the weather. Turning nice tonight and the sun setting, uh, bugs aren't like crazy, so got a windshield full of them here. Let me see if this works. We're gonna spray it and try to wipe them off. Yeah, I don't know if it shows it, but I'm a little impressed. That actually uh, it took, I'm gonna say, 80 to 90% of the bugs off. I'll hit it again real quick. And that took care of the rest of them. There are no more dead bugs. Uh, again, it didn't show up real well, but there was, I don't know, a dozen of them or so right here in front of me. They're gone, so yeah. Not bad, another point for scrub blade.
All right, it's got the new 11 inch rear blade that's gonna go on the wife's car. I don't have one for the Forerunner. Apparently the Forerunner uses a factory special something that, uh, that scrub blade doesn't make one for. So uh, we'll put this on the wife's car. She's got scrub blades on the windshield already. So this will be a nice match for the rear window. Get it on there and show off full, blade, full scrub blades all around too. Okay, so that was the uh, the rundown of how the blades have performed for me over the last, what is that, six, seven weeks now that I've had them on the Forerunner. Um, are they absolutely perfect? No. Do they get the windshield perfectly clean every time? No. Uh, do they work as good, if not better, than any other blade I've used? Yes. Uh, I'd run them again. Uh, you know, they take a little work to get all the bugs off, but I don't know that there's a way to avoid that. One product that I do have from Scrub Blade as well that I haven't tried is they have some tablets for the washer fluid. They're supposed to help with the bugs. Um, I have not tried that yet. Wiper fluid I've been using is actually a Rain-X brand. I've always had good luck with it. Um, I just haven't, one, ran it out of the system, and two, been able to tell Toyota to not put fluid in every time I go in for service. So uh, next time it's empty, I'll put some fluid in that has that Scrub Blade solution tablet in it. Uh, so again, hope you liked it. Hope it was informative. Uh, if you want your own, again, there's a discount code linked in the description below. There she goes again. She keeps thinking she's going to find something. But uh, yeah, like I said, I'm happy with them. Uh, the wife's got them all around in her car. She seems happy with them. At least she hasn't said anything otherwise. And I don't know, just wanted to kind of review them after some usage instead of just an initial review. So like I said, six, seven weeks, and they've treated me well. Hit a lot of bugs, been in a lot of rain. Have not been in any snow, but I suspect they'll work just fine in the snow. So, anyways, hope you liked the video. Hope it helped you out. And like I said, link in the description below so you can get your own with a discount code. So, thank you. You see that little hummingbird up there? Hanging out on top of the tree. Let's see if we can get close to him. There he goes. All right, one more thing. Sorry if the wind noise is bad. It's a little windy out here. Don't have a microphone on this camera, not an external microphone. So uh, that's one of the things I will be getting eventually, but trying to deal with that for now I'd rather make it work without one just because it's easier but uh, if it's too bad sorry i'll fix it i promise